What makes us in the image of God? We speak and things happen. God calls those things that do not exist in the natural as though they exist. When God saw darkness, God didn't say, wow, so dark. It'll become darker. What did God say? Light be. God calls those things that did not exist. What did not exist? Light. God calls light and light was. You must believe when you pray. Whatever you desire, when you pray, right then there, believe that you receive. So many of us, we reverse the whole thing and say, when I pray, I think, where's the pain? The pain is still there. God didn't answer my prayer. You see, we, we want to have it before we believe we have it. But God's system is different. God's, God's way of faith is that you gotta believe, you receive, and then you will have. God lives in the realm of faith. Amen. God wants His people to live in the realm of faith. Feel the feelings, but don't go by it. Jesus was crowned with glory and honor. He showed us what man was supposed to be like. He spoke, all right, and the dead were raised. He spoke, and the fig tree died. He spoke, and demons fled. You gotta believe you have it. You gotta own it, and then you will see it. You will taste it, you will smell it. This generation, we have the revelation that this is nothing more than the language of faith. God calls you blessed before any blessing is evident. God calls you healed before you walk in that healing. And it's all because of the one who hung on that lonely hill and bled and died for me.